the structure of the cell membrane, you will recall that the cell membrane consists of three layers. And these three layers are one, there is one phospholipid layer that is sandwiched between two protein layers. Now the phospholipid molecule consists of the fatty acid part and a phosphate molecule. So this will be the, the fatty acid and the phosphate molecule. Actually there are two layers that make up the phospholipid layer. Then on either side of it there is the protein layer. Within the cell membrane there are pores. The functions of these pores are very very important. We're going to discuss this function shortly. Now, if you look at the cell membrane, there are certain features of it which gives it the properties that control the movement of substances into and out of the cell. These features that play this role include the pores, then on either side there are electric charges, both positive and negative charges. Then by the very nature of this cell membrane, particularly the protein, the cell membrane is sensitive to changes in temperature and the pH of the surroundings. Then the thinness. The cell membrane is quite thin and this has a great influence in the rate at which materials will be moving into and out of the cell. Then the structural proteins also have some additional role which influence the movement of materials into and out of the cell.